Do you hate using your glaucoma eye drops every single day? Have you ever wondered if there was a better way to do this? Let's see how. Hi, I'm Dr. Roxanne Lee. I'm a board certified ophthalmologist and in this video, I would like to tell you about a medical device that might be the magical ticket you're looking for to get rid of your need for glaucoma eye drops every single day. What I'm talking about is the eye dose intracameral implant. Let's get into it. When it comes to glaucoma treatment, the name of the game is to lower the intraocular pressure, which is the pressure that is held physically within each eyeball. It's really a simple concept. The pressure will exert stress on the optic nerve. So if you lower the pressure, you lower the stress on that nerve, which is the cable that runs from your eyeball to your brain so that you can see. And with less stress on the nerve, you lose less of those physical nerve fibers year after year. Less loss of those nerve fibers equates to less vision loss over time. So the scary thing about glaucoma is once you've started losing vision from this disease process, there's really no getting it back. So it's really important that we focus on prevention. Prevention of either starting vision loss in the first place or prevention of making that vision loss get worse and worse progressing over time. So you know there are a lot of different ways that we can control this eye pressure. The first and most common way that we try is with an eye drop. So eye drops can be very effective in lowering the eye pressure and controlling the glaucoma progression, but there are lots of other options that we can play with, whether drops are not working for you or if you don't like the drops. One of the really cool classes of glaucoma management options is a medication implant. And one of those medication implants that we'll be looking at today is called the iDose. The iDose is an intraocular implant that lives inside the eye. It's implanted over the course of like a five minute surgical procedure and it stays in the eye and releases a steady dose of medication called Travaprost, which is a prostaglandin analog glaucoma medication. And it can continue to release this medication for three years. So the main study that looked at the effectiveness of the IDOS in glaucoma patients showed that 81% of patients were able to get off of all of their glaucoma eye drops and actually stay off all of their eye drops. With the IDOS implant in the eye, the patients don't have to worry about using eye drops daily or even multiple times a day because the medication is already doing its work and it's already inside the eye without you having to put the medication on from an external source. Like I said, the surgery takes about five minutes to do in the operating room and it has very minimal recovery. Let's watch one of the eye dose implantation procedures together so that we can see how it's done. This patient is undergoing a combination cataract surgery and eye dose implantation. Her cataract has already been successfully removed and we are putting in her new intraocular lens, her lens implant that will help her to see more clearly. Here we're just rocking that lens back and forth inside the capsular bag so that the legs of the lens can open up and anchor the lens in proper position. This cannula is being used to introduce a little bit of medicine, antibiotic and some anti-inflammatories so that she can heal nicely. And this second cannula is used to introduce some clear viscoelastic into the eye. The viscoelastic is a thick but clear jelly-like substance and it helps to fill the potential space within the eye to open up an area for the eye dose to go in. So the eye dose implantation is what we call an angle-based procedure and so all that means is we are working in the anterior chamber angle of the eye and to visualize this this is why I have tilted the patient's head away from me, facing away from me, and we're using a special gonioscopy lens so that we can look into that corner of the eye. So here we are introducing the eye dose implant and we just lightly dimple into the trabecular meshwork area. This is the natural drainage gutter of the eye and it anchors securely into that space. Perfect spot. 
So this is the patient at post-op day one. She did very well with the surgery. She's feeling great, seeing wonderfully as well. And we're examining her eye here at the slit lamp. So you can see the eye dose implant is visible at the slit lamp and is nice and stable. And the patient doesn't see it, the patient doesn't feel it, but her eye pressure has responded very well. With the implant, we expect to see an effect, hopefully, of a full three years of intraocular pressure control. Of course, every time we see her in clinic, we're going to measure her pressure and make sure that she's still doing well. But from here, so far, she's doing great. Thanks for watching and learning about the iDose glaucoma implantation with me today. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. And if you found this helpful or interesting, please go ahead and like the video and subscribe to the channel for more.